Hey there friends and enemies, Joe here again and today we got the story trailer for Final Fantasy 16 and I'm very excited about this. I've seen some screenshots online, it looks tremendous and I can't wait to check out the trailer with you guys. Give my thoughts afterwards, it's dropping next year and I cannot wait. This is one of my most anticipated games of 2023. It has been 1500 years since the fall of our forebears. And Valisthea oh, has good. been slowly dying ever since. Oh yeah, this is a gorgeous game. I'm so ready. Not much further now, but we're in the middle of the Deadlands. The blight suck this place dry. Meaning no trees, no birds, yeah, and no dog, magic. Let's go. Darkness spreads as day the dog, gives way to twilight. The mother's flame now all but a flicker. We cannot live without the blessing of the crystals. Oh. And the crystals work their magic through us. You a have been blessed, of locales. That's great. But who shall claim their fading light? The Grand Duchy of Rosaria, bastion of tradition. At the very least, we must secure Drake's breath. The Holy Empire of San Breck, where that ambition is gorgeous. divine. The Imperial Banner shall fly over every city in storm. All shall bow before their Emperor. The Dalmechian Republic, whose fortunes shift with the desert sands. And what of our wise rulers? Goaded into war without any thought as to what chaos it might reap. The Iron Kingdom forged in faith and fear. Their souls were sullied with this stain. Oh, I like earth. this. I merely cleansed them of their corruption. Or the Kingdom of Wulud, indomitable in its isolation. This is Dark a lot. Swallows more of the realm with each passing day. And as the fringes fade, the people that flock sick. to the mother crystals. From a single spark, will the land ignite? In the year 860, the Imperial Army will march upon Rosaria. Oh, he's got murked. Oh, and no. From the slaughter shall a new shadow rise. You freed over here? Painting their destinies black as night. Oh, I like the partial transformation. Should command respect, but instead has left us outcasts. And so I became their puppet. What makes them think they have the right to use us? To leave us to die when our bodies are spent. I'll crush him! Flay him! Oh, that's sick! Okay, I'm in. This combat looks great. I need all of it. You who shall bow to me. Very well. Come then. Show us the strength of your will. Rise, ye crownless kings. A reckoning is upon you. A war of the okay. icons. Yeah, that looks sick. I'm in. Summer 2023, let's go. So we saw a lot in there that was very exciting from the partial transformations. I like that a lot. Like where they kind of get some of the abilities of their icon, but not really the full transformation into a massive piece. Like, and that 
adds to some of the abilities that you'll see in the game and the boss fights, obviously, because uh, if they have partial abilities, they're not going to be fully transformed, but they can get a little bit of those abilities to use in the game, and, and it just looks tremendous. I think overall, the dynamic between all the different realms is interesting. This is cool because this is like a party gathered i it looks like it's all like single character you don't really get a party which is the only downside i've seen in final fantasy 16 so far is like i'm more of a like traditional like final fantasy 7 you get your party you can pick and choose what characters to bring along into your party level up equip certain things i like that and i'm a little bit bummed that we might not see that in final fantasy 16 but the setting is tremendous i feel like the grand scale is cool all the different factions some rivalries, all that kind of good stuff is good. I'm, I'm looking forward to that quite a bit. And the combat looks like it's going to be a lot of fun, even though it's not a traditional turn-based Final Fantasy or anything like that. So, uh, like, this just looks epic, right? Like, this whole scale is tremendous, and I think that's really where the game is going to shine, feeling like a high fantasy epic, which is, is really, really cool. Now... The cutscenes are obviously going to be gorgeous, but I, I wonder how you're going to relate and care for the different characters. Like, obviously, this is a guy we're not going to root for. He seems like kind of a villain type character trying to rule the whole world. Uh, the main character will be interesting. This guy, I kind of like him, to be honest. He's kind of like rugged, a little bit of a badass, so that's cool, but yeah, the main character is, oh, we really got to This is another guy I probably won't be a fan of, but... Hopefully, we have characters that we really, really get to know, fall in love with, and uh, that's what will make the game better, worse, S-tier or not. So, I think that's something to keep in mind. The combat, like I said, uh, this this right here, a wild, wild event, right, to show in the trailer. We're already getting some, uh, some wild backstory that is going to set up this character's future right there. He's going to freak out and summon his icon. And then after that, we get gameplay. So, uh, like, look at them. He, the p partial Phoenix cloak looks sick. I, I can't wait to see it in action. And then, yeah, like I said, from combat, we've got some pretty good fights, right? So we got your standard HP here. You got your various attacks down at the bottom. Cooldowns, all that kind of good stuff. Uh, massive enemies, potentially. As well as normal sized enemies as well. Which is good. I like a little bit of variety there. A lot of unique looking abilities. Which is uh, the number one thing about Final Fantasy. You got to have a bunch of dope looking abilities. That can be used to change the game. So uh, overall, I'm excited. I think... Uh, I, I'm hoping that there's a one main uh, giant uh, summon that's going to be the end boss that is kind of pulling the strings. I think that's what we would imagine will happen with Final Fantasy. Uh, typically, uh, in those stories, we see that. But overall, I'm just so excited about this game. I've been waiting so long for the next iteration of Final Fantasy and I think this is going to be an absolute banger. They're taking some risks, but I think that's a good thing. And I can't wait to see how well that pays off. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button. If you want to see more content from Final Fantasy 16, a full playthrough, all that kind of good stuff on my channel, hit the subscribe button. Definitely stay tuned for that. Let me know in the comments down below. Are you excited about this game or not? What are you most looking forward to? My name is Jopa. I hope you have a good one, and I'll catch you all later.